Lazy River Drive in Dallas. Neighbors say it's normally a quiet street. But that clearly wasn't the case Thursday afternoon as water began shooting from a hole in the road and covering Donald Campbell's home. Thunder, water, rocks coming all over the top of the house. I said, something ain't right. Campbell said the loud sounds left him shook and he watched gallons of water showering his house and flooding his cars. The homeowner says he was caught off guard. I had a garage up too. And I went to the garage, garage just gushing in like that. I said, oh man. As water continues shooting from the ground and what city crews are describing as a six inch water main, that wasn't the only emergency neighbors witnessed on this street. Firefighters were responding to a house down the block. This house was on fire. And so we saw the ambulances and the fire trucks come. And when they turned the water hydrant on to set it out, that's when the, I guess the water pressure sparked the, the water down there. Firefighters are saying that emergency was separate from the water main break. In addition to water, we've been seeing large chunks of asphalt shooting onto this house. Neighbors tell us this has been going on since about 10 o'clock this morning. Lazy River Drive appears to be buckling in some areas. Neighbors are hoping the issue doesn't lead to a sinkhole. That's a lot of water. I said, why well, didn't get the water out? You know, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. I said, I said, well, don't panic. Don't panic. Yeah. Man, I'm panic anyway. After several hours, Dallas Water Utilities arrived with a backhoe, plugging the hole and diverting the water from Campbell's house. Workers said they're trying to minimize shutting off water to any other homes in the area. Meantime, Campbell has this advice for all homeowners. I have a lot of insurance. Please, you got the insurance. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.